Uh, we have also moved in other areas to build resilience. We are very big on the issue of climate change. As a small island country, we recognize that we are extremely vulnerable. In fact, within the last 20 years, Antigua and Barbuda has been hit by 12 hurricanes. And I recall back in 1995, we had Hurricane Louis that literally decimated the country and destroyed um, perhaps up to a year of GDP. So we recognize that we have to play our part in terms of reducing our own emissions and at the same time to ensure that we introduce strategies for adaptation and mitigation against the effects of climate change. So, so far, we would have committed about 100 million EC dollars to acquire green energy applications to include solar voltaic as well as wind power. Presently, about five megs have been installed and by the end of this year, we would have had about 18 megs of green energy that would have been installed. Prior to achieving the governance of the country, we had pledged to have at least 20% of our power generation coming from green energy. But by the end of this year, we would have exceeded that 20%. And we expect to continue to make that transition into green energy so that hopefully within the next five to 10 years that we'll get up to at least 50%